this is another Jarvi Edits, a workflow hangout. It's been a little while since we've done this. Um, and I think the last time I did this, I probably had Dave, Dave Veffer and Jennifer on it, probably, huh? I don't probably. Know. Probably. Yeah. But I've been out and about, Bolivia, California, all over, moving different places, and and uh, I thought this was a fun photo shoot to uh, do another workflow hangout. What that means is I will basically just be doing my work and talking about what I'm doing and fielding questions. I know Dave and Jennifer have done this a bunch, so they fielded a lot of their own questions that they've had in the past. Um, but if they have any other, like, reminding me of things that were cool that I talked about in the past or just shooting the breeze about life, uh, just let me know. And then I'm excited that Lisa's on here because I haven't done that with her, but I know Lisa. Hey, guys. So, so Lisa, you get to kind of, like, figure out what's going on here. And, and don't let me, you know, off easy on, like, like just kind of glossing over things because... Uh, sometimes I just think, oh, yeah, totally. You, wait, everyone knows that, right? <laughs> I am happy to ask all the noob questions. I, I have no shame when it comes to that. <laughs> okay, and um, I will hopefully be, uh, from time to time, fielding some questions from uh, the conversation going on over on the event. In fact, let me share my screen so you can see the event. We'll go here to... Events and is my screen being shared? Yes. Okay. And uh, yeah, so just like uh, Michael Devaney said, questions asked here? Question mark. And yes, questions here. And I'll try to uh, get on it as soon whenever I see it. I'll maybe just have it on the side over here. Mm -hmm. Uh, and uh, just, uh, you know, let me know if I forget to change screens so that you guys can see my screen. Um, uh, we've got, here we are in Lightroom. And Lisa, you use Lightroom? I do. I just started about eight days ago, so I'm very new to Lightroom. Okay. Perfect. That's all right. So we are in the library function here. We're just a grid view of all the pictures. Um, I'm going to go pretty fast because I don't want to go slow. And I think people will be happy that I'm going fast so that we can actually get it done because it's going to take a long time to do the first couple of steps. But we'll, we'll tell <laughs> stories and I'll tell maybe little tips and tricks as we go along for other different little things, okay? Um, to kind of, because we're doing the same task again and again and again. So, you know, to keep it fresh, some extra stories. Um, and let's Hi, see Helen. before we start. Hi, Alan. Hi. Hello to Helen. I haven't seen you in forever. Hello, hello. Good, good, I'm good. Good, good, I'm good. Oh, and I, I did mention that the, the bride <laughs> might be jumping in later, too. Right? Mm -hmm. Yes, that's cool. So mm -hmm. it'd be fun the to bride. see her. The bride. She's... Oh. Actually helping, she's helping her brother, or she—I I guess she's moving. You know, well, they get married soon, so. Um, and they want to do their engagement pictures a little while ago, but I was gone on a road trip, so. Um, I, I you know I just got back this week, and we did them, and uh, and the deal was that I would edit them real fast. So I did these last night, and they're going to be edited tonight. So. Actually, I would have done them last night, but I was so tired, I couldn't do anything. What's your usual turnaround time for stuff like this? Uh, engagements are much faster, so I try to do it within a week or so. I don't really ever say how long it's going to be because it's all I don't want to get myself in trouble. Very clever. Um, but, you know, engagements, there's only going to be like 50, 60 pictures, so I can edit those pretty fast. Okay, my philosophy is... I'm just going through and asking myself yes or no questions most of the time. And I'm, I'm stopping right now just to kind of discuss what, what's going on. The first yes or no question as I'm going through the very first time is, would the bride want this? Like, is this something, or, well, the couple, like, is this good? 
and will they want it, and do I want it to be shared, you know? So I'm going to totally avoid any blurry pictures, uh, get rid of those, and I'll just pick a lot of these good pictures. That doesn't mean that they're great and I'm actually going to end up using them, but I'm going through for the first selection round, and there's going to be two or three selection rounds. So pretty lenient on this first one, uh, just kind of gut reactions to it. Don't internalize it. Don't think about it too much. It's fast. Boom, 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 boom. Next picture, next picture, next picture. Um, and then just go through it again and do uh, a narrowing down of the pictures, like a pyramid. The base is we're starting with 597 pictures that were taken yesterday. And hopefully getting down on the first round maybe like to 200, hopefully even less. But don't try to force the issue too much. Don't try to like have a fixed number and you're just like, I have to do this. Because then you start internalizing. To, you, tr you spend way too long like, ah, do I need this one? Do I not need this one? So it's a matter of being quick. So getting into this takes a little bit my mind to start thinking through this. I like that one. I'll try to say what I'm doing. What happened at first is I, I sit there. This is me telling stories as well. Here's the couple. Um, I'm telling them how this is going to all happen, right? Like, this is what we're going to do. They're like, hee, 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 you know, this is the first time we've taken pictures together. We're cute, we're in love, and we're a little shy. And, and he's saying, I'm not good at this, I'm not good at this. And you're like, no, no, you're good at this, this is great, you know, this is going to be fun. And then I kind of just I tell them, look, my personality, it, or well, my type of photography is personality driven. So I want you to just have fun and do stuff. And they, and they, they kind of look at you like, well, that's easier said than done. Mm -hmm. And so you kind of have to reassure them that, you know, I'm going to direct you. I'm going to tell you where to stand against this little pillar because it's got good light and it's got a great background and you can relax against it. And um, I'm going to tell you where to be, and I'm probably going to, you know, direct you to, with as far as light goes. And they love this next part. I usually say, um, and I will tell you if you're doing something stupid, you know. <laughs> so, um, yeah, and, and I do that, and I'll say, well, you know, I'll tell them things like, you know, put your hand that you know in your pocket, and I won't tell them exactly how to do it, but you know, just kind of in general, where to do that, or stand in front of them, stand in front of her, and you get a lot of like poses that aren't going to work, uh, situations that just were f that that didn't work out great, and in that mix, you get a lot of really fun, good ones, like great backgrounds and great moments, and uh, and a lot of the clicks, a lot of the a lot of the pictures you take. Well, for me, a lot of the pictures are, are going to be test pictures, figure out lighting. Because I could sit there for a while and figure it out before I take a picture, but it's a matter of speed and keeping the flow going for uh, the clients and not really being too distracted by your technology. Uh, so you take a couple pictures. It doesn't hurt anything. Well, it kind of does these days with 45 megabyte files. <laughs> but oh well, I'll delete those later. <laughs> um and some of them are just kind of funny to make him laugh and make him a little more comfortable. It's like, you know, I probably won't use that picture, but um, but, it, but it made him just get more used to it, get to have a little bit more fun, to do my test shots, to, you know, get those moments when they're laughing and joking, even if they look awkward, not because you're going to use those pictures, but because it's going to just make things happier down the road and more used to it and and it encourages them to interact if you if they interact and you go click 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 it's like a reward it's like Pavlov's dog you know like that's probably a bad <laughs> analogy to like start talking about a couple and then start talking about dogs but it, it kind of is let's be honest it's like if they do something great you click and that's like oh I did something great that's what that tells that to them I did something great I'm going to keep interacting. I'm going to keep on coming up with my own things to do. And in plenty of those situations, I will give directions. So my clients say, hey, you don't pose very much. But I, get, I talk to them, and I tell them things to do frequently. 
in my opinion. But I think it's the different types of things that I do as compared to maybe other or what they expected. Um, so what I'm doing is I'm using the P key, P as in pick, because that's what I'm doing. I'm picking pictures, reactions. I'm going to be wrong, and you just have to let go, Lisa. You just have to let go. Make sure that you're always right on the really good ones, and you're always right about not picking the really bad ones. But you're going to be wrong on the ones in between. You're going to go, hmm. I could have picked that one or the other one. You know, it's like, whatever. Uh, you just have to let go and go for speed. Uh, because the assumption is this is a workflow for someone that does a lot of pictures or doesn't have a lot of time. This isn't for, like, um, this isn't for, you know, someone that does commercial work for uh, and uses Photoshop and is going to edit two pictures for a client, you know? Mm -hmm. This is someone that does a lot of pictures, is going to return a lot, and is going to get them done pretty fast. Mm -hmm. And then do more and more shoots. So uh, this first round, we go through all of them. But if you think about it, uh, if we're only picking, hopefully, maybe 200, the next round, we're only going through 200, and then the next 100. So... We'll get done soon and be able to pick out our top 50 or 60. I will breathe now. Let you ask a question. <laughs> so you end up with about 10% that you send to the client? Um, well, my goal, my goal is to kind of, I want to, I really want to get it down to like um, 15, my top 15. Um, and then maybe edit the top, if it's uh, engagements, probably the top 50 or 60. Um, weddings is like 500, you know, <laughs> wow. that I end up giving them. And so some of these are, well, you can probably see them. Some of these are pretty nice, they're fun, but they are a little soft, blurry. And that is bound to happen because I used, <laughs> this is interesting, I used the 85 millimeter for the whole entire, um, the whole entire shoot, mm -hmm. just so you know. I had three lenses with me. I took three lenses out of the car and walked around with them, but I never switched. I just used the 85 the whole entire time. Does that happen very rarely? Uh, no, I've done that frequently recently. Um, you know, what, the couple portraits, I'm usually going to end up using the 85 or the 7200 anyways. And the more and more I use the 85, the more and more I'm able to get better at it with its really shallow depth of field. Because it's not easy. You, get, you can get a lot of out-of-focus pictures that way using that lens. Mm. You've already got some editing going on here. You've got a preset that, yes, that, that was applied to them, correct? Yes, yeah. there is a preset applied to them. My typical preset, if you know Lightroom, will go quickly into develop real fast. Um, my biggest things are at the bottom, I have chosen a profile. And my profile mm -hmm. for this Nikon camera is Camera Vivid. Mm -hmm. That won't be available for... Uh, Canon ones, but you can choose some other profiles that might work for you. And then I have shadows up way high and highlights way down low. I did a, a touch of whites, a touch of blacks. I mean, the biggest things for me are the shadows in the profile and a little bit up on contrast. I have the point curve up to medium, even though sometimes I take it up to a uh, strong... And you've got a vignette going on there, too. And is there? Yeah. Um, oh, I did a little bit of, like, quick look through on them. And I was just like, oh, these will look good in vignette. So I did that on some of them, yeah, for sure. Okay. Um, what else? I do a little bit of darkening on luminance, even though that really wouldn't matter on this one because I didn't get blue skies in this particular location. So yeah, 
So that's my typical look, is to have this uh, vivid and mm -hmm. to do a little bit of contrast and the still light. So, And you'll see when I'm editing, it's mostly going to be doing dodging and burning and kind of like putting my own little vignettes on things and uh, a little bit of sharpening and whatnot. So in certain of these, uh, I guess, like poses you're seeing, uh, mm -hmm. if you see down here, you'll see that there's a flag. Uh, that means I picked that one. Um, some of them, I'm picking a lot of those pictures. And like for this pose, you see, I, like I picked one, and it's probably not even that amazing. So <laughs> some of them are winners, and some of them aren't. Like I like I like these ones. Mm -hmm. And I told her just to kind of do <laughs> stuff, goof around, you know. And it's really funny here. Here, there's just a second she like dips herself. Usually it's <laughs> like the guy dipping, but she just like leans back, and he's like, "Oh, I guess I'm dipping." <laughs> She's really cute. I've known her for like four or five years now, so it's kind of fun. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I know that you saw both uh, Jennifer and Lisa. I know you saw their video, didn't you? Is that the little that hand drawn one? Yes. The cutest thing ever. Adorable. Yeah. Really cute. Cutest thing ever. <laughs> I think my favorite part was how he got a call out of the blue from <laughs> Bob Ross. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. Everyone should go watch it. Yes. Someone on the um, the event should post a link. That video here. Awesome. Um, and again, if you have any uh, questions, what were I kind of I guess to recap, what did you gather? Let's have Lisa recap it. Just now on the uh, on the selection process. Yeah, what, what we're doing. Um, I don't know. For me, the biggest takeaway is that as a photographer, you have like a decent intuition in terms of what's going to work and what's not as you're going through this stuff, um, and so not overthinking it and just being like yes or no, um, and then moving on. Yes, a yes or no question is so much faster than a one, two, three, four, five multiple choice. Is that a three? Is it a two? It could be a three, but maybe it's a two. Uh, I think it's a two. Let's go with two. Uh, otherwise, it's just like, just freaking just go yes, no. Yes, boom, next. And, um, and then the next time around, what we're doing, what the benefit of the next round is, is that you are not just, because... There's portions in here where you're like, that's bad, 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 bad. And then you get to one, and it's like, oh, that one's not bad. And you're like, oh, this is amazing. When really all you're doing is comparing against all those other bad ones and realizing it just wasn't you know, bad. It was okay. It's not really amazing. So when you go through the next round, you know that they're all okay. And so you can then tell yourself, are these better than okay. Are these great? Are these good? And you're like, yep, this one is good. This one's, you know, it will remain okay. This one's good. This one's good. And then uh, you just keep on doing that. The next round you're like, I know that these are better than okay. These are all good. Now I want to figure out which ones are great. And it's that same yes or no. Boom, 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 boom. And it helps. It's not just about speed, but it, it does improve quality. So all the blurry ones are gone in the first round. Yeah, you won't see them again. Actually, if we were doing my true workflow, I would have gone through all of these and looked specifically for ones that were blurry. Even if they were kind of good, mm -hmm. like this one, I would, I would look for those and just do a whole round of just finding those and using the X button mm -hmm. and, uh, and deleting them. Because, and I used to not do that, I would still X them out, but I wouldn't really actually go to the point of deleting them. But I do now. You want to guess why? Because they're so big. Because they're huge files, and my hard drives are full. They yeah. are, like, packed full of pictures. My last trip, you want to guess how many pictures? 
I have no idea. Was I went from the uh, was it two on, weeks? On the eleventh till the thirtieth, or the twenty so, ninth. More than more than two weeks. Yeah. Ten thousand. Yeah, it was twelve thousand. Whoa. Wow, that's huge. And that was several trip? days where I didn't even shoot during the middle of the day. Usually in my road trips, I'm like, go, 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 go. But this last one, I was like doing a lot of work for the photography decathlon and not shooting half the day and just doing kind of sunrise, sunset. But it, the wedding was a lot of things and a lot of pictures. And during the dance thing, I did kind of like stop motion type stuff, and I did a ton there. Mm. So there's like 3,000 from that wedding. So do you, when you go through photos, do you just delete some of them? Like you just delete them and say, I'm never going to look at these again and be okay with that? I used to not do that, and I used to not be okay with that. But with the huge of files, um, if they are blurry mm -hmm. and you just can't use them, it's not even like if their eyes are closed or whatever, but if they're just really bad, I'm willing to let them go, yes, <laughs> and delete them, and they'll never exist again. <laughs> How often do you go back and, like, look at... Doing photos yoga. that maybe you didn't process. This is yoga? Obvious. I guess. <laughs> one, one of them looks like they're doing yoga. <laughs> yeah, he was like doing the... She's like, this is how you do it. Yeah. So this is their second change. We'd already gone back and she'd got a little dress on. And there's a couple of things that I'll have them do um, that are kind of like I have a lot of couples do. And this is kind of the one where you kind of like hold hands in between and then like look towards each other and stuff like that. I like that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. But it's, it's how they execute it. I'm not going to tell them exactly how to execute it. Let them put their own little spin on it. And when she did this, mm -hmm. see how her knee was like this? That was just a temporary thing, but I saw it. And yeah. She put her leg out. And then I told her, I'm like, no, Kelly, you're leg in was perfect. So I wow. see a lot of what people do and say, go back, go back, what you were doing a second ago. Yeah. So, no, no, put your leg back in a little bit more. There it is. That was it. Okay, we're good. That was it. That's done with that one. <laughs> and so I had them stand here. You see how it's like they're not even paying attention. It's just a terrible picture. <laughs> it, this was all about lighting, all about setup. Take a picture while they're getting set up. Don't, that's one of my big things. Don't do test shots with them paying attention. Like, don't mm -hmm. say, okay, look here, and you click it, and then you look at your screen to see how it looked. That's a test shot. And if you did that, and you, their attention is fine. I mean, they're going to get tired after a while and all their moves, you know, they're going to use all their moves after, after a while. So, you know, do that while they're picking their nose or something, you know? <laughs> Well, they're not paying attention. So this is one of the ones. And I said, have a moment. And I think she was whispering into his ear. <laughs> and sometimes they're not like, you know, that's not really that photogenic. But How long does a shoot like this normally take you? Um, right now we're at about 40 minutes into it, 40, 50 minutes into it. So... And a lot of it was, you know, we started at a particular time and we were going to probably go until the light was kind of out. So I think yesterday we shot for two hours. Okay. And I don't put time limits on it because it's nice, actually, if we're done, we're done. And they don't have to feel like, mm -hmm. oh, we have to use the X amount of time. Mm -hmm. And I don't want to also feel like, you know, I want to be able, if, if it's going really good and they're having a lot of fun, it's actually kind of cool to, like, you know, just go a little bit longer. I do happen to like taking pictures. <laughs> and that's my suggestion. As a photographer, you should probably like taking pictures. And if it's really a big bothersome chore and you just hate that they took 20 minutes longer than you wanted, then that might be a sign. <laughs> so... Okay, and so here's the thing. We used all those fun places and shots and everything, and now they get into more of the formal look, which is actually what they're supposed to, they're, 
their idea was in using these pictures for their announcement. Uh -huh. um, so let's hope that there's some fun shots in here. And there's going to be a lot of uh, no-goes on these ones because uh, I'm using flash lighting yeah. and sometimes the shadows just don't work. And it's a lot more of me doing other stuff. I can't Were you all by yourself? I was by myself, so I put this on the little uh, ledge to, your, to the side. Mm -hmm. And then some of them I was holding it in my left hand while I shot with my right hand. Because I'm talented like that, you know? <laughs> what up? <laughs> And it was, it was, it's kind of humorous to see me doing that. It does lead to a few more blurry, blurry pictures. Blurry pictures, yeah. yeah. Harder to get the focus. So... <laughs> and this is where it's just like, do faces. <laughs> See, test shot, doesn't matter what they're doing. Just get it done, see how the lighting looks. There was one of these little, uh, if you see this pillar right back here, there's another mm -hmm. one right here, so I was able to lay it on there for a little bit. Okay. Well, it's not perfectly ideal, but this is a good spot for it, and she's having fun. See, okay, and see, here he is, he's got his hand down, but you'll see, like, I'm going to have him put his hand in his pocket in just a little bit. There we go. A lot better. Yeah. It, that's a fun little smirk by him. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, my lighting is a lot of just, like, it, it's it's circumstantial. Like, the lighting is what it is because I had to put the light where it is, you know? Mm-hmm. Um, I didn't really feel like bringing, it, bringing out the light stand, and I had it in the car, you know, I could have, but just, I was like, let's let fate decide how this is all going to, <laughs> you know, maybe I'll come up with something different, keep it new, keep it fresh, you got things that you know will work, we'll sometimes do other stuff, and just see if it will change it up. <clears throat> So, again, um, don't think about it too much. Just I know it goes slower to begin with. Um, you know what? You can make decisions. This is my opinion. With a larger screen, you can make the de decisions better and faster. Because you okay. can quicker. You're quicker to judge how in focus it is. Mm. And it has a bigger visual impact on you. Because these are all pre-rendered, right? Because otherwise you're waiting for it to Yes, focus. definitely pre-rendered. Yeah. More faces, and these aren't working because I was out of focus. Oh, well. <laughs> Different, you know, lighting thing, and that didn't work out. And there we go. There we go. That's cute. Was this in Utah? Yes, this is in Utah. It's a place called uh, Memory Grove or Memorial Grove. Uh, it's pretty popular. I think we saw we saw two or three bridal shoots going on, maybe wow. two other engagements, uh, family pictures, and then like a, a troupe, like a dance troupe is what it looked like. In that same two-hour period? Yeah. <laughs> so they all kind of came and gone while I was still shooting, you know, so. Mm -hmm. And it's funny because that will happen a lot, like I'm still shooting while other people are going. I don't know. I just, it's one of those things that seems to add value and it's not too much, you know, extra. And they were looking for a bl just a blank background. And we know that this worked with the city and everything in the background and they live in that in Salt Lake. And, mm -hmm. um... And then they're like, oh, where's a bl blank background? And there just weren't any around. And it was just, I think, a little too late to move to another location, just too much. And 
And we tried to use this area, and it's just not the shadows behind them. If you see that, it's just yeah annoys me. So, and I told him I was like, yeah, with your formal ones, I know you guys want to use um, the you know there's probably not going to be that one that you were talking about. So let them know that. Okay, so this is the fun game, the fun part of it. I think Jennifer and Helen knows this. Um, how many pictures? How many pictures? So everyone <laughs> also watching as well gets to guess. We started at 597. Um, and how many pictures did we pick for that first round? So on the count of 3, 2, 1, we all just write down a number. 3, 2, 1, go. You guys write it in the chat or on the event. I don't even know. So I'm going to guess one. I said two. 80. <laughs> Did my guess go in? There we are. Michael thinks 332. And again, this are, there is an event for this. Actually, Jennifer, could you put on the Hangout, the on-air Hangout? public stream, like the link to the event. Okay. That would be great. Okay, 250. I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> I did click a lot, didn't I? Yeah, you did. There, a lot there were a lot of good ones, yeah. Yeah. Oh, baby. <laughs> I was right. Uh, 180? 185. Wow. wow. Good intuition. Uh, Keith was good, too, 179. Well, I think he just did one lower than you. <laughs> oh, because he saw mine. 179 plus or minus a half. Round is 185. I actually like that number. You know, there's probably a lot of those other ones that might have been pretty decent. But, you know, it's good to get down a little bit faster. Lower number. So now we're going to use the... I have the a one. question. Yeah, go for it. Do you have, like, a, a, a very limited number, like one or two or five, that you really process a lot out of in the end? Or do, do you do, like, a special one, a special image? Oh, uh, yeah, if I post one on, on uh, Google+. Plus. <laughs> or the first five or ten that I'm going to put up there, I want to make sure look really good for their um, gallery because those are the first impressions to them, to their, to their friends, to my potential clients. Um, but to say I process a lot out of them, it still just means I'm in Lightroom. I'm just, you know, making sure the contrast levels are perfect. Um, uh, you know, no bad distractions and stuff like that. Mm. All right, you have to drink of water. <laughs> so now the next step, let's go down. And without even trying, sometimes it just ends up being half. So, I mean, a good cut on this next one is probably going to be like 80. That would be awesome. Um, <clears throat> all right, so... And again, if anyone, uh, well, not again, but I just want to let people know if they are, uh, you know, intrigued and interested, they can uh, let me know and I can, uh, they got a bunch of questions or a bunch of insights or, or whatever, you know, they can come hang out with us in the Hangout. Otherwise, uh, you know, thanks to all those that are watching out there. That's cool. We're going to do the next step. And I will maybe do a little better job of seeing which ones I worked on. I the kissing one. Oh, it's kind of a funny story. I guess going through pictures are a fun time to tell stories. But she's like, oh, and we're good at at kissing and gazing <laughs> into each other's eyes. She was really goofy <laughs> about that. Those are good skills to have for a photo shoot. <laughs> And I think I took him to the side and just did this one, just because he was like a little, you know, I'm not, you know, whatever. But, yeah. Um, I was like, okay, here we are. We're going to break you out of this. We're going to just get you just in front of it. And it was kind of like him laughing. He's like, oh, no, just me. 
So and, Corey okay. so on the, the event is, is wondering. Are, oh, Corey on the event is wondering why DNG instead of NES. Uh, I, it, it saves a little bit of space, and you know, with huge files like this, I'm kind of going for any way I can save space. That wasn't used to be my issue, um, but now it is these days. And the other thing is, they say that pre-rendered or for the DMGs that Lightroom does something that makes it faster. Lightroom 4 has some way of interacting with DMGs that makes it faster. Have you noticed that? I haven't done the actual time testing, and I'm sure <laughs> that it's just a very, it's it's not like huge, but it's like minimal. So I think you have to look over the course of a lot of pic pictures. Um, this one's fun. Uh, you know, it's a little soft, though. So I think I'm actually going to get rid of it, because we have like five from that same pose. So uh, In the next round, I'll probably start getting a lot of your input. And if you ever like go, aw, or laugh, or, oh, great, you know, even those little insights are huge. I don't know if you look at pictures with other people around, that little insight like teaches you a lot about, that's how I, you know, I think I learned a lot about photography in the beginning is I took pictures of couples and I went through the pictures with the couples right there and I didn't look at the pictures, I looked at them and their reactions and I began to learn what it is people like. So, oh, this is me just like, walk down the the path, look at each other, do cute things. <laughs> I said, just bump into each other, lean into each other, just, you know, <laughs> push them over. I don't care. Oh, I wish she was in here. Kelly should be in here because she would, she would prove my point that that's what I did. <laughs> Let's see here. There's some fun lighting. So, you know, I think a big part of this, seeing the pace that I'm doing it, it's pretty seems like a pretty decent pace, right? I hope. It's very fast. Especially for the quantity of photos you're dealing with. Good fast computer. That's will help a lot. Okay, so I wonder about these ones. What do you guys think about these ones? That first one. The first one, the second one, the pose is, isn't as flattering as the first one. This she one. looks a little this concerned. I think it's like the wrinkles. This one's be better. Yes. This one's like better than me. Are any of them good enough to move up? Yes. Okay. I mean, it's just kind of a, a, a little less typical of... of yeah. Pose, so like getting but, but her her gaze, her look, and her eyes is very nice. Mm -hmm. I think you also have to let go. Like with, y you want to know exactly which ones they're going to like, and and be able to like, mm -hmm. just guess at it. Like I know everything, but you're probably going to be wrong, and they might not. They might choose like the last picture that you let in, you know, as their favorite. But a lot of experience and a lot of seeing what they choose. And, and don't just look at, like, go, oh, why did they choose that one? You know, like, that's not really going to help you learn anything. You start, yeah. you don't, like, second guess. You're like, why did they choose that one? What is it about this picture? I know that there's obvious problems, but they probably weren't looking at those problems. What were they looking at that made them choose this? And take that and then do that same thing, add that same thing into the really well taken pictures. You're like, why did they choose a blurry one? Well, why did you put it up in the first place? Um, but there's something about it. They don't know blurry or not blurry, probably. There's something else about it that they liked.
So he was busy putting his shoes back on, and so I was like, here, come over here. Let's do this. So. Do I ever get couples who are extremely uncomfortable in front of the camera? Um, yeah, well, uh, you know, I, I think a lot of portrait, like you could be good at taking pictures, but a lot of it, I, I don't know, you guys do portraits much? You th I haven't. Um, yeah. I've taken pictures of people, but I haven't like gone out to take portraits of people, which I, I know is different. Yes, I met some, I've had men that are terrible. Don't want to do it at all. If my wife and my kid look good, it's all that matters. I had that said to me. Yeah. So you just, it's, it's a lot about that little interaction, you know, with them and just making it feel like it's a fun time out. That's, well, that's me, you know. Like, we're just hanging out. Um, I'm sitting there talking about my life with her, you know, like <laughs> what we've been doing and what I've been doing recently, my trip. You know, she's asking about, we're talking about girls in my life or something like that and just, you know, fun things and uh, I'm talking about their story, you know, how they met and they're like, well, obviously you didn't see our YouTube video. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I don't know, just random talking, not really making it seem like a big thing. So Robin says sometimes they pick based on the expression of how the other one is looking at them, which is a good point. I think that's mm -hmm. that's how I pick a lot sometimes too. Well, it's it's a mix because I'll pick also with how good my job was, you know, like how good of lighting and how good of framing I did. Um, and then I I see I'm like oh that's great framing and lighting, but they look dumb. Dang it. <laughs> Uh, Scott, Alex says, hey, uh, how long does engagement session last? How much time do you spend shooting? And how many locations do you go to? I'm willing to go as many locations as they want, but we kind of picked the same one. or we, we stayed in the same place. I said, yeah, we can go as many locations. I've got these other locations. And when they got there, it's just like the mood that they're in. And they're like, no, we're good to stay here. I'm like, okay, then. I'm good for that, too. Because uh, I can get fun stuff here and and you can see it has a wide variety of looks all in the same location, right? Totally. And I've shot this location a lot. I've gone there for probably maybe even a dozen photo shoots over the career. But hmm. I don't think, I think I repeated very few of these and I did a lot of new stuff. And mm -hmm. I've been, I've done uh, a weddings at the Salt Lake LDS Temple. I've probably done like 30 of them in that same place. And yet I love shooting there because it's, I can, you know, I push myself to do different things each time. And, um, and I know that that's not, and not every, some people have a hard time with that and that's understandable. Um, but what we're going to do here then is look to see how exactly how long a time it is when we finish this up and we got another 10 15 pictures and then we'll have everyone kind of guess again and that's kind of like I I, I, I call these ones like the grandma pose <laughs> not because they look like grandma but because this is the one grandma wants <laughs> like their friends want the, you know these other fun cutesy ones but Grandma just wants to see him. She wants to see what his face looks like. And she doesn't have that good of eyes, so she doesn't want it to be too far away. Yeah. And, uh, and that's all right, you know. Like, it's cool to have those other ones and want those other ones. But these announcements go to other people, and, you know, you can't be too selfish about it. But you get to have the other ones for lots of other pictures to put on, like, the tables at the wedding and stuff like that. So, all right, we are, we are done. So while you, everyone is putting down their number right now in three seconds on the event, I'm going to look to see when I started. Actually, you can, um, yeah, let's see here. 
my time is actually wrong on my oh no it is right no it's off by two hours <laughs> I need to change the time on my f camera oh I need to change it big time so it said 9.15 p.m. It was actually 7.15 p.m. when we first started. And then we went until 11.05. So it was an hour and 50 minutes. So we had we were at 184, and I'm going to guess 70. And we've got 96, 60, 75, 72, 91. Cool. All right, so I'm going to filter it down. Oh, I was off. So the winner looks to be it was eighty nine. Ooh. Wow. Um, Adam. Corey had an eighty seven. Robin. I said ninety. Corey. Robin, ninety one. Oh, Who's Helen saying? on the Helen. on the chat said ninety. Okay. Helen said ninety. Well, good job. That's amazing. <laughs> I got it down below fifty uh, percent. That makes me happy. Um, that just means less rounds, you know, because I might do one or two more, and that's it. But these ones are going to go real fast. <laughs> so on this next one, here, let me text her. See where <laughs> Jarvi, it's past is. three for me. I'm going to go to sleep. But okay. I love seeing your work. I love seeing your enthusiasm. Oh, thanks. Good night. I love seeing Good night. you. Good night. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Man, three in the morning. <laughs> it's grease for you. Um, and we got some other questions here. We got we got a couple of people that are asking a few questions, so I'm bringing them in. Scott, if they want to, they can or they. Michael Bonaclo wanted in. Somebody else wanted in. Okay. Michael is in. Um, and oh, I don't know if I'm following her. I don't know this name. <laughs> do, do, do. <laughs> there she is. Okay, guys. So with the vignetting, did you go through all 500 and just throw it on there for some of them? Yeah, uh-huh. Which ones did you pick, and how did you pick them? Oh, I just texted the wrong person. I texted <laughs> another friend. I said, you around? And she's like, call. <laughs> I better just tell her. Oops. And a okay, what was your question? Vignette. Oh, okay, so what happened is I imported them all and I forgot to put my standard import. So I just did grabbed a bunch and I was like, well, let's do this one and then I synced them to the rest of them and mm -hmm. I did the vignette on some of them cuz I was going to probably do that eventually anyways. So I don't do vignettes a lot when it's sky involved. I don't like vignettes on sky. Why not? It was very few sky vignettes. I kind of just like using the gradual filter um, on sky instead. Okay. Uh, just kind of darken it that way. I don't like the darken in the corner look on sky. So um, on sky. Oh, it's gotta sky. turn off the hangout, Michael. Uh, just kind of darken it that turn way. I don't the, like the darken in the corner look on sky. <laughs> Mute. Okay, yeah, you have to turn off the on-air portion since you're in here now. All right, so for the next step, um, well, let's answer a couple of questions. Uh, yeah. I'm starting it into portraits, and most have been, oh, Michael, don't leave us. Okay, and most have been uh, comfortable with me, but a few have been super uncomfortable. How do you break that? Uh, well, I don't know. Some people just need to... My answer is kind of cheap and easy. It's just like I don't really seem to have that much of... Well, it's 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 things that I do that are very based on me. Like I'm just goofy and 
and I'll just do things that are just totally awkward or goofy awkward just because I can get away with that. <laughs> but uh, some people, their approach to photo shoots are a little more professional and business type, so that would be a terrible idea for them. <laughs> <laughs> um, I just you know smiling a ton and just being really happy helps to avoid those types of things I think to begin with they're just oh I'm happy to be here um, giving them an expectation of like you know this is what we're doing and wh how we're going to do it and letting them know I think one of those big things when, remember when I first started I was like I'll let you know if you're doing something dumb or if that doesn't work <laughs> That right. instills a lot of trust that you, you have to let them believe that. Mm -hmm. That if they're going to mm -hmm. do something bad, that they that you're going to let them know. And so saying some of those things from time to time really helps. Like move your hairs on your forehead. Perfect. Mm -hmm. It's not a huge deal, especially if you're zoomed out. But they will, it's not just about that picture. But they start to trust you more. Why? Just come up with some stupid thing that doesn't even really matter just to let them know that you're paying attention to details. Mm -hmm. um, and, and some of the feedback that I'm giving them, it's like, uh, no, you know, do a little bit different. Um, do, you know, different little pose there. Oh, no, this one's not working for us. It's all right, you know. Like, Or maybe I'll say, like, you know, that was a bad idea by me. You know, let's, let's go over here. Do this. This would be great. And you take a couple pictures. You look at it. And you're like, well, my idea sucked. <laughs> and uh, make them laugh. But I guess you got to make sure that they are confident enough with you. They're not like you're not like worried that they're actually going to think that you suck. You know. Okay. <laughs> um, let's let's go to the next round. And I want a little bit more in uh, feedback. You know. All right. So. Um, this one could be cute. It's a good one of just her. She did say she liked the kissing ones. Yep. They were good. So that one to me looks like it's a tiny bit overexposed. Oh, is yeah. that something that you can work on with Lightroom? Or is it That's a good point to bring, at, bring out is that you go through these pictures and I'm showing everyone kind of like the unedited. Well, they're, you know, they've got the, the basic edits on them. Um, but you are looking at and you're viewing based on potential. Don't look at the picture how it is right now. I like how we're stuck on this like really bad exposure picture. <laughs> um, maybe we'll go to the next one. Don't look at how they are right now, but kind of because you've edited pictures, you know how a picture can become. Yeah. Look at well, so that's kind of what on. I'm asking. Like if you look at the one we were just at, is uh -huh. that something that you could salvage yeah, in the I know. I know based on my camera and my skills in editing that this one can come out really good. Okay. So I am not looking at it how it is right now. Get over that hang up and, and get good at seeing potential. Mm -hmm. And that's going to be hard because here you're seeing one where I already actually did the vignette and it's going to be unfair advantage, you know. <laughs> it's yeah. decently exposed. But, um, you know, there's things still to be done on it. So... I like the hug. That was cute, and it's a good picture of her ring too. We gotta do one of him. Um, I like their expressions in this one. I mean, it's really just a toss-up between the two of them, but don't get too caught up on it. You know, they're probably gonna mm -hmm. end up with both of them, but we want to find out which ones are really good. Mm -hmm. But I, I, I love to hear which ones are just like, ah, oh, that was great. And I should say to Robin, if if you just have a mic, that's fine. We don't need to. Uh, you we, don't really need to see. we don't need to see. We don't need to see. It's fine. You can come in. I, I think like the uh, kissing really one a lot. This one. Yeah. The background is great on this one. Yeah, I like how you have those three like kind of layers. Too. Yeah. Yeah. Something about really he smiles big too. I mean, yeah. both good. You're getting into this point where we know that they're good, we, but we want to find these great ones. Uh, framing on this one's just great. So, ooh, these are like the same picture. What did I do? Pick both of them for? You liked both of them. <laughs> well, I'm gonna get rid of one of them. At least you're consistent. 
Yeah. I like these eyes ones. Yeah. And the flowers in the background. I think I remember saying something like, ah, oh, let's get you some flower pictures. We know you love them. <laughs> and that kind of cheesy type of thing just doesn't work for everyone, so <laughs> be careful. Like, you see this old guy shooting a wedding, and he says these cheesy things. Um, okay, Kelly is, so she's here. Let's invite her again. She doesn't have a, a camera or a mic. Oh, well, I guess she's watching. <laughs> she's at her office, doesn't have a camera mic. I like the one where they're looking at each other. Yeah. Uh, at the here. The door ones. Okay. Yeah. Cool. I might not have picked that one, so good to hear. And of those two, I like the first one better. So you know why he was standing right there the whole time, and she moved around? Because there's like a little placard on the door, something about like historical <laughs> ah, location. Ah, clever. Very clever. And I was like, okay, you have to hide this if you do this door. This I like one, that. I love this I one. I like that a lot. That one's cute. And I think people go, well, what about the blown out skies? It's like, well, that's just how it is. And um, lossless DNG, just someone asked. So. Oh, I, gotta, I like I, this one. I know, but it's. Oh, I'll just do some sharpening on it. <laughs> it's one of those ones where it's like, he's just kind of, <laughs> his hand there, you know, just kind of funny. So that was one of the things I did a lot. Um, I can see this one being a black and white kind of moody thing. It's not. It's a little soft on him, but. So. All right. Yeah. With the dress, like good. Uh, yeah. Uh, there's just a a sign on the door that was had to do with this location and like I, I think it had I think it even had like um, little brochures in it it just was a distract it's just anything that takes away from them is kind of a distraction I like this one and that's what someone asked so that's why I mentioned it this one right here the one where they're both looking up at the camera yeah that one's super okay. cute yeah I just wish I'd not cut off the the shoulder. <laughs> oh, well. Shoulder, or no, that's not a shoulder. That's an elbow. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> These ones probably not as good as our other ones, or I mean, I'm still asking about. The I like them. It's maybe it's just me. Jarvis, you just got muted. <laughs> like four times by Scott. I don't know if he knows he's doing it. Oh. Oh, okay. So what did we miss? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Uh, yeah, so... Love that one. In here in the water by herself? Yeah. <laughs> I did this. This is just for fun. I think she's embarrassed probably by that one. <laughs> Uh, but we're going to let her have that one anyways. Oh, yeah. So what I was saying when I was muted was um, that, what was I saying? Oh, Kelly, get a mic and jump in. Hurry up. She's watching, she says. But we want your input. <laughs> or at least go on the event page, and there's a lot of people conversing there. Yeah. So we'd love probably people ask questions to her, I think would be great. So one, two, three, ask questions for Kelly about me, about the photography, about the experience. And my um, question is, which ones, which of these poses and scenes are they really, she really digging so far? 
I'm curious if she felt awkward at all, because I would feel awkward being photographed if it was just like me and the guy I was seeing. Um, and then also if she's done photo shoots before, because uh, she's super photogenic. <laughs> yeah, she is. And maybe here's another question. What did Tim think about it afterwards? What did he say yeah. about the experience? Hey, Scott. Yes. Um, I got in here late. Did you mention what you were shooting with um, lens and body-wise on this? Uh, D800, and I shot with the 85. I, I took around the 7200, the 24 to 70, and the 85, and yet I only used the 85. I never switched. Okay. Thanks. Um, yeah, where does she go to respond? She's having a hard time finding that. Um, Go to my Google Plus and down like two or three posts ago, you will see it's uh, there an event and it's called Jarvie Edits Live Lightroom Workflow for a Recent Engagement Shoot. And you click on that and people are just, you know, writing in there and asking questions. And we probably should repost the link to the Hangout or to the to the on-air yeah. portion of the Hangout. Don't, like, copy-paste the URL for you guys that are in here. <laughs> okay. Um, so we're good. We had 88, and now wow. what do we do? Now now go ahead and make your guess, and uh, right now, just start guessing what we got it down to from one star to two star. Took us a little longer than it normally should, but because we're answering questions and talking a bunch. And feel free to keep asking questions. I'm going to say 40. I said 40. I said 42, I think. I don't have it posted. thought about yeah, saying 42. <laughs> I went 45. Okay, and she does say that if you give me five minutes, she'll be at Tim's house. And Yay. we'll have the camera and mic. Yay. So we'll, we'll keep some more questions for that for then. Okay, uh, two stars. We have 47. Ah, oh, dang it. <laughs> oh, well. Okay, so that was kind of the in-between, you know. Now we're really looking for, like, really good ones. Like, we have to be really... This this is the step where you're, like, you're trying to get down to the 20s, <laughs> and you know that okay. you, they're going to have to be really legit. So, next step. Is this one legit? You know, you gotta get in that mindset. And and my mind thinks I probably should have one of her, but the lighting and well, the colors just aren't my favorite on this one. And I don't know I don't if really I know. yeah. Um, I think this is kind of a really classically cute little kissing one. They're good at it. I like it. <laughs> uh, the hugging one <laughs> with the ring, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? It's kind of a tender moment, especially when it goes into, like, I think in black and white here. Yeah, that's a good one. Like, mm -hmm. and, and once I change the contrast levels and exposure. So. Mm -hmm. um, and then definitely the one of him smiling or smirking. I like the smiling. I like the smiling one better for sure. Okay. And... I don't know how we feel about the kissing one. I like the smiling one better there smiling too. Smiling on that one, yeah. It's I love the I love that location. Um, it's a little crooked, but whatever. We got to do one of these. I think this is the one right here, huh? This the smirk by one. her and a good yeah. smile by him. Yeah. Okay, the door one. I like the foot up. Maybe. Seems like there's a lot more of these. Did I get rid of ones that were really good? I like the leaning better than the foot. Yeah. Yeah, leaning definitely. Okay. We'll just, you know, it's it's crooked, but that's to do next. Uh, lean up against is yes. cute. Good one. Okay, there we go. Uh, I think this is a great kind of just composition here. Leading lines and... Frame. Yeah, it's very nice. Uh, 
uh, this is cute and it's fun, but it's not like yeah. a really good description of my photography per se. And he's probably not like his best. It's cute. Yeah. They're gonna get it anyways. It's not a three type thing, you know. Yeah, I like this the other like, this one better. This is such great lighting on them. Good expression. That's great. Great. Looks great. great. They both look great. Elbow kind of. Oh well. Yeah. The elbow is the problem. Yeah. So. I don't know if it's a huge that problem. One, yeah. <laughs> this one's great framing. Yeah. And he looks good. So it's a. It's yeah. kind of like a. Cl it's like a solid, good picture. Not like. The yeah, most it's, creative. It's kind of pose number eighteen. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Um, okay, so here we are. Good framing. Um, I'm going to change up the colors and stuff, I think. Cause... And that one is Yay. good. we got to have the ones of the two of them together, so I'm going to do that one. Yeah. And then this is the one of her. That would be good. That's yeah. good. This is like the pose 16, but it's not even as good. <laughs> <laughs> and I even mentioned that. Like, I was doing these things, and I was like, you know what? This is very cliche. Yeah. You know? If I can do a really good job at a cliche picture, it doesn't matter. Like, people are only disappointed with cliche pictures when they're not really good. Yeah. So. And it might be in 20 years that that pose comes back into style. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Um, I like the framing and the location. Yeah. I don't know what to think about that one. That one for sure. <laughs> then, yes. Yeah. yeah, I like that one a lot. Okay. I like this location a lot, so I think I'm going to pick this one and that you one. Know, the that one that one. I edited earlier today. And then <laughs> made another one for like the Facebook uh what is it called up top? The wall ones where everyone puts a little... Oh, yeah, that banner launch. thingy. The banner, the banner. yeah. I think well, it's called I, something else. I don't know what it's called, though. Okay. Well, and then Google Plus has a banner thing, too. And on the event, I needed a banner, so... Okay, uh, we definitely need to pick a few of these ones. And luckily, that's really cute. I'll actually stick my hips to the side, and they'll just get the point, like, oh, okay, <laughs> I can be all girly and stuff. Uh, the black door? No. Um, someone asked if I saved any in front of the black door. There was one that she really liked. We'll review it. Um, and did I miss anything else? Cover on Facebook. Cover, I guess. They Cover and photo. Well, what I invited that? Michael Bonacore, so <laughs> I don't know where he's at. I don't know what happened to him. So someone's like, where's Michael? Um, Okay, I like the crossing the feet. She was doing it normally and naturally anyways, and I just reminded her. I was like, earlier you were doing like the, you know, do that again. Yeah. And then this really, you know, like the scene and the lighting, people ask, well, what should I wear? I'm like, I'm really actually not very good at that. Am I stuck on the right picture? Do you guys see her with her feet crossed? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. I I'm, can't see what I'm looking at anymore, so... <laughs> Um, okay, and, and so I just kind of remind her, I'm like, you earlier were doing this, and, uh, oh, okay, yeah, I was talking about the clothes. I'm like, I'm not really so amazing at clothes, so I kind of just kind of, like, BS my way through it, and I'm just like, any, you know, I give, like, an answer they don't want to hear. It's like, anything, you know. But I, what I do tell them is I'm really good at matching your look with the type of pictures I take. Mm -hmm. Like, this matches the outfit that they're in in my opinion. Um, and this totally matches. Matches the outfit that they're in, in my opinion. Okay, M Kelly, we muted you for a second. What you have to do is um, close the on-air hangout yeah. a and stay in this one that you're in right now. It's giving us some feedback. So you had both things going, so you're getting like a loop sound. Yeah. And Tim... Yay. <laughs> okay, so when you close the other one, go ahead and unmute yourself on the top right-hand corner. <laughs> <laughs> I love watching people learn to use the tools for the first time. Hi, can Kelly. You, can you hear me now? Hi. Hey. <laughs> Sorry, I meant to be on earlier. I got stuck on a phone call with a client. You were watching... Well, Kelly, 
this is everyone. Yeah. Hi. Thank you for judging our picture. <laughs> <laughs> it's easy. You guys are so photogenic. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thanks. Oh, Tim's a handsome man. <laughs> He's a lucky man. Uh, I hope so. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to tell the people, because they've got a little bit of delay, um, that they can uh, go ahead and on the event uh, write is questions for, for Kelly. And then I'll let um, Lisa and Jennifer and Mike and Scott ask a couple questions right now. And uh, we'll, we'll take a moment, and then we'll continue to go at, while they're still asking questions. <laughs> but anyways, okay. Lisa, you had one earlier. Yeah, but I, I liked yours better. Um, what did Tim say afterwards? What was his reaction? <laughs> Tim actually said they wonder what, what your reaction was after. Um, the after the, the, the photo shoot, yeah. Um, well, I can tell you what I remember he said. You want me to tell them what yeah. he said? He said I was a lot less, um, it was more fun than he was expecting. Um, yeah. And something about I was less like stressed or something than he <laughs> thought I would be during it. <laughs> so that was good. We, yeah, we both said that was really fun. Even though we did get tired towards the end of, like, we just didn't know what else to do, well, you know? Well, and, and then the fake, you know, you're, you're forcing, not, not forcing smiles, but you're, you're having opposing smiles the whole time. So it gets a little tiring, to be honest. Yeah. Those but not all of our smiles were posing, because we were, we were having fun. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want to say it wasn't a good time. <laughs> so did that ask you like it was the right length of time? That's the question we got. Mm. Was that the right length of time? Do yeah. you even know how long it was? No. What did it feel like? About two hours. Maybe two hours. Uh -huh. Is it, I think that's about what it was. It's like a good date night. Yeah, <laughs> it was a nice date. Um, Tim got to know me in some very close-up ways that maybe he hasn't before. <laughs> like this? Like that. Well, you Woo. know. <laughs> I, for, to be honest, um, it was okay because we really wanted to get shots with all three of those outfits on. And so mm -hmm. it, it was about the right amount of time with each outfit. That's how I felt. Would you agree? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Jennifer, do you have a question? All right. I, that was a question from the group. I, I'm looking for more. Um, what was your favorite part of the whole thing? Is this to Tim? For you. Both. Okay. What was our favorite part? Um, oh, gosh. I don't know. I, I think... Well, occasionally Scott would show us what was happening, but like, like yeah. he'd show us a couple of sneak previews. He, I agree with that. I really enjoyed that, especially when yeah. he caught us doing something like I was teasing once, and I don't know if he showed you guys the one where I was I was thinking about doing a little butt grab, you know, just as a funny thing, and <laughs> <laughs> and he he actually caught it and sort of and and. So, <laughs> So those are kind of, that's fun. Yeah, so I just want to understand the audience. Are, is everyone on here like aspiring photographers? Is that what we've got? Because I can speak to that. I, I think Scott made it fun. You know, like he would um, he just, just try to get us to do things. And then, and then we kind of like, like joke and laugh about something. But, but he was going yeah. the whole time. He took something like 500 pictures. Yeah. So. We liked that he was catching candid stuff. Yeah, yeah. that made it cool. Okay, we're going to go through this uh, kind of this, uh, our, what we've kind of come up with of top, well, actually, we, we do this thing where we're guessing. We, we got it to two stars. We got it to 48 pictures, and uh, we went to three stars. So what do you think that we at? And we put it in the event here. I can't put it because I actually just peeked and saw how many it is. So people can put down their guess, and I'll let them know. And these are all the pre-edit type stuff, uh, just for you know Tim. He just started watching. 
Um, not that I do too much to them anyway. I was going to say, I don't think they need much. <laughs> they look pretty good. <laughs> All right, so the answer is... No one else is guessing? Oh, no, no. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, I, I think it's funny. just a pretty long delay right now, I think. We started at uh, 44 or something? Anyways, it's 26 is the answer. Mm. All right, so here's what we came up with. We thought this is fun, and you know, your your ring is really good on this one. And then, because you said, "Oh, we're g really good at kissing and gazing into each other's eyes." <laughs> <laughs> so, so this is our moment to embarrass you. <laughs> and you got a good and a good one of Tim. Wow! Yeah. Yeah. Our first location here. Mm -hmm. I really like the background of this one. Yeah, that one's great. Uh, the close-up. You want one of the good mom and dad or the grandma shots? Oh, that's what he looks like. <laughs> that handsome young man. A door shot. Cute. Walking down. Another one. Second outfit. Tim's really excited in this one. I like that one. <laughs> I know. There you go. This is your moment to shine. Tim will like that one. Cute. Close up there. Oh, the precious Ooh. one. This is one of the ones I showed them. Uh huh. Good. Right, you guys, I have to bounce um, okay. and out to dinner, but thank you so much for having me, Jarvi, and uh, okay. congratulations, you guys. These, these shots are amazing, and you guys are both very photogenic, and good luck with everything. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for your participation. See you later. Yeah. Bye, guys. Bye. Okay. Yasmin asks Kelly, yeah. um, actually, let's finish up with this, and then I'll ask the question in a second while I'm doing the next thing. And these are the, this is your actual, you know, like your outfit, right? But you really want to make sure you got some good ones. So, uh -huh. cross the legs, looking at each other. Nice. Here's the next spot. A hug. The next spot. And the city ones look good, actually. Love those. Yeah. So, um, okay. Picks. So this is the moment if for someone that's starting to do this cooling down, up and down type thing, and they don't have a lot of experience, there's a way to kind of do this fast, get into the motions, and then kind of remind yourself if you did a good job or not. You know what I mean? Like, did, did, was it successful? And this is the tip to do that. You bring it into grid mode, and, um, oops, you bring it into grid mode, and you start with the one stars, and you say, um, and you just do an equal, so all the ones that are exactly one star. And you look at them and say, are any of these really not like the others? Like, you play the Sesame Street games. Are some of these not like the others? And you say, first of all, are any of these really not worthy of being in the same class as the others? And so you can kind of look at them, and, and you'll kind of like one will just pop out to you. It's like, this one's not as good as the rest. And it doesn't have to take long. It can be a fast type thing. And you're like, no, these are all pretty good. You know what I mean? So then you mm -hmm. go back through them and say, are any of these like stand out because they are better than the others in this kind of quick kind of way? And you like, look at this one over here in the top corner I've, that I've highlighted. And I, that one just kind of stands out to me as being a really solid type picture. Mm -hmm. And I don't know. And this is, this is where you're like, you just have to guess what the client's going to think about her expression. She could be like, oh, I like my sassy expression. Or she could be like, wow, I look tired. I don't know, like, whatever. But luckily, we have the client here, so we don't have to guess. Yeah, hello. And yay or nay? Me? Yeah. I think I like it. Oh, gosh, don't ask me. Uh, <laughs> I don't dislike it. Okay, we're going to put it up just right now. Putting up to two stars is not a huge deal. Mm -hmm. Maybe we put up the, you know, the, the bum touch there. I think I saw one, though, that I like 
into star that maybe wasn't? Okay. We're going to get to two star in a second. Oh. That's our oh. next one. Are we looking at one stars right now? Yep, just the one star. Okay, then I saw a one star that I like. It Which be one? Better. Um, go up. You're at the top. Oh, okay, then go down a little. <laughs> Hold on, I can't see it because somebody's, somebody else is in the shot. Uh, oh, you can click on, yeah, on click me. On. Click on Scott oh, Jarvie down below pattern. and it will stay on me. Okay, so go 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 back up then because I missed where you were going. I'm sorry. Are you at the top now? I'm at the top. Oh. I probably maybe I moved it already into two. Oh, you might have. Maybe okay. Okay, okay we're good then. Um. So you just kind of like are any of these standing out? This is to kind of like you you did the whole process, but you want to just double check if you did it well. I don't know, Kelly. Is this one kind of cute to you? Yes, um, I really like the one just under that and to both sides of, of the one under it. That, that line, I really like all of those. Those close-up ones, the ones we were asking about earlier. Yeah, I, and that next one, too, where the, like, the smirky one. This I one? Like all four of those. Yeah. Okay. You be like honest. this one with your... Yeah, yeah. yeah. Pick yeah. another one that's your favorite. Pick another one? There's three left now. Oh, so out of those three? Yeah, you like the kissing one? I like the not, I wouldn't pick the middle. I'd pick the two on both sides of the middle one. Okay. Sorry, Scott. <laughs> that is fine. Okay. Um, how about this one? This one stands out because it's fun. The one with your bum out. Yeah, I kind well, I want a copy of that whether you pick it or not. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Of course. <laughs> any of these else, other ones standing out to anyone as being like? Did you, Scott, did you put one of those where I, we were sitting, um, let's see, the one that's next after the one that's highlighted the, on the next row? Uh -huh. That one. Do you have one of those in the two star? No. Okay. So. I don't know if it. I love his face on it, but I sure love that um, pose. Okay. I kind of like it. Okay. Um, I don't know. What else? You, you like this one because your calves look good? <laughs> You're like, I'm a runner. <laughs> well, I, I don't know what you put in two stars, but that's the only problem. I, I do like... Yeah, what, what you're doing is comparing these against the other ones, you know? Okay. So... And maybe that's what we should do. We can, I can edit all of the two stars for you and get them to you tonight. So tell me any of these that you like, and I will just highlight them and make them two, just because. You ready? These are two. I thought these were one stars. Yep. Yeah, so I'm going to make two, any of them that you want. This is your decision right now. Anything that you tell me that you want, we'll go into You'll two. edit? Yep. yep. Oh, Starting with the top line. Anything on the top line? Fast decisions. There we go. <laughs> yeah. What do you want? Okay. Um, I kind of do this like is that a shopping one. Cart. I kind of like um, the first three. <laughs> okay. But I promise I won't pick the next one. <laughs> okay. This is why you should never have your clients do this work. No, that's fine. Actually, happy. they choose less than I choose. Really? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Usually, so, maybe not but, all the time. But remember, I haven't seen the two, three, four stars. Yeah, yet. and we're going to go to two, so maybe you can, like, oh, never mind, and get rid yeah. of it. Okay. Yeah, and I don't want to waste people's time, though, either, so tell me to just be quiet when I need to. I think um, they're having fun, right? Okay, <laughs> yes. so I would say no on everything on the top row now. Okay. Um, I would say... <laughs> I think I would say no to the next three. I'm not sure about that that last one on the second row. It's kind of cute. Okay. And um, then I would say no on the next line. Okay. No on the next line because you, you do have a different one, have, right, of me uh, dipped. Yeah, okay. we have the one, yeah, with him. Yeah, we have a different dip one, yeah. And then do you have a different one with my toe up? 
this one over here? Yeah. I don't know, but I like it, so we'll keep. We'll Let's keep, keep that one. Okay. Um. That's when Tim was making funny faces. <laughs> don't do that one. <laughs> um. Okay. Yeah, I think. This is a possible one. This is the bottom row. And you guys have kind of a fun expression. Do we? I can't see our expression very well. Yeah. So. Well, we're just doing this one as a fast kind of like go yeah. back and forth and look and see. Okay. So I think I've, is this okay. the bottom? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So now we're going to go to two. Okay. And this is your moment to say no on some of these. And we'll put them back down to one. Okay. These are two stars. Yeah. Okay. Yes. So you have to get into the client's, for everyone else, get into the client's mind and, you know, just kind of pretend you know which ones they're not going to like. But here's the client's mind as she tells us. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Which? Yes. Do you want me to go one by one? Yes. Do, do, one. do one by one. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. 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 Got to go fast. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no. Chin. He's he's doing he's not right here. Okay. Do you want an opinion, Tim? No, no, it's all right. <laughs> he's gonna watch. He's gonna watch. Um, yes, because it's candid. I know. Oh, he's... it's the same picture. We could get oh. rid of. Oh. Okay, let me see the other one slower. No, we, no, they're the same. I just got rid of one of them. Oh, you did. Okay. Yeah. Would you want both of these with the flowers? I think go to the next one. I like that one better. Okay. So we're going to go down on one of them. Just yep. Um, yeah, that's a fun one. Yes. Mm, just so so. Okay. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Well, well yes. <laughs> Obviously. Yes. yes. Okay. <laughs> Your expression is great. My expression is great. I don't even care what yeah, you say. Yeah, and Tim's got a cute face, so yes. Yeah. Yes. 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 <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Sorry. Um, yes. Yeah. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> love that one. That's the one I was talking about. So there um, was another one. There that. are two of them now. Him smiling big or not? Yeah. We'll keep them both. She likes the pose. Okay. Yes. We don't even let her decide, Tim. This is obviously... <laughs> You gotta do the yoga. <laughs> okay, yes. <laughs> yeah, that's actually pretty good. And the other one is a three star, uh, so. Okay, that one's just so so. My foot looks kind of funny, I think. Yeah, okay. Good, I don't mind not having to edit another picture. <laughs> um, I like that just fine, but do you have those higher as well? Or, or those are the ones you. No, yes. yeah, those are uh -huh. good. I like those. So yeah. maybe we just keep the this one and not keep the other one? Are they the same one and just edited differently? No, no. He's got his head next on yours and stuff oh, like that. Oh, okay. Show me the other one again. Yeah, I, I like... Uh, you're right. Get rid of that one and keep the next one. Okay, because there's another one that's a three-star as well. So. Oh, okay. Yep. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Uh-huh. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Okay. That's all I needed to hear. Um, okay, we got um, three stars. I want to make sure that there's you like all these ones. And let me know because I'm happy to get rid of some of them. So. Okay. These are three stars. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Uh, yes. They can be moved down, and you can still have them. Just tell if they're not your favorite. You know. Okay. Yep. So that's a yes. That's a yes. That's obvious. Yes. Yes. 
Yes. Yes. Yes. Yes. Uh, just because of the distance on that one, it it might be a two. Okay. But I wouldn't get. I want it to be at least a two. Okay. That, that one's a yes. Okay. That's. You know, I so. love that one. <laughs> yeah. Yes. 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 This is giving you an idea of what a three is. So I'm just okay. going to go through them quick. Okay. Cause Cause I want them all. all yeses. I want them all anyways. So. <laughs> What, what I wanted to go back to two is, is any of these way good that you wanted to be a three? Yes, I want the one where I'm leaning against him on the, uh, well, I really like that one, too. Okay. So I like that one. This one that I'm on? Mm-hmm. Okay. I would make that a three. I would, I would almost get rid of, now that I know you have a different flower shot in the three and I like it, you could move that one down. Okay. And you don't have to edit it, yeah. Okay. Um, the same goes for this one. the leaning one. Yep. Yep. Okay. And also the next two, too, because you've got a, a better shot in the three of both of those, right? Yeah. Well, this one, y he's hiding you a little bit. Uh-huh. The other one's a little bit better. But yep. it's just one of my favorite shots, so yeah. that's why I couldn't really get rid of the other. But we can. That would be easy. Kay. Okay. So I really like, um, I would move, keep the rest where they are. The one on the end there, on that uh, same row just to the end, I, I think that one's a three to me. Okay. And, and then I think, um, boy, I love all three of those ones. Especially I know you love this one. I saw you heard your... Yeah, oh, that, that one too. Yep, that's This a one three. too? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay. And then show me these two up close, the two that are um, leaning in his lap, because one of those was a three for sure. Okay, now go to the next one. Now go back. Yeah, the one with his teeth showing. Go to that one. Okay. Okay. But I would like that other one too, just as a two. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Keep... Uh, yeah. I think we're good on the rest of them. Okay. Do we have one? See that on the second row up? Sorry, at the bottom. That one on the left? Yeah. Do we have one kind of like that in the threes? I think so. We'll, we'll move it up there just because. Okay. Yeah, because I, I liked that one. Okay, we're good. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, so here's a, here's another quick question. Scott just asked about um, sp speed lights. Uh, when it went to the formal pictures, like right here, I started using a flash, and we talked about that a little bit earlier. And I was kind of just like holding it in my hand, kind of funny. Um, that was that was pretty fun. Uh, but the rest of them I didn't, and it was pretty good uh, lighting in there. Just didn't even really need it. And the next question is to the couple. Yeah. What made you choose Jarvie? <laughs> what sealed the deal, Miss Kelly? What sealed the deal? Well, Scott and I have been friends since like 2005, and I remember when he used to share like his vision with me of what he wanted to do with photography. Um, so I always like, you know, was excited about what he would do. Um, at that point, I didn't know if he would really do what he was wanting to do. <laughs> but uh, I don't know, Scott. We've just kept in touch. And, you know, he did a free photo shoot um, in December that me and my friend Jacqueline, who he's also good friends with, um, went to. And um, he, he took this awesome picture on Temple Square with these lights. It was Christmas lights in the background, and I just loved the photo that he took there, and he shared it with me. And so, I mean, I knew what Scott could do. Um, so it was a little bit a combination of having, of of like our friendship, to be honest, and also having some experience with him, um, where I saw what he, what he did, um, 
and it was nice to get that experience as just a fun night out that I didn't have to like, you know, it wasn't like I wanted a photo shoot. It was just like, oh, let's go hang out with Scott and get a couple of pictures, you know. From that earlier thing in December. In December, yeah. yeah. Exactly. And so, so being able to get just a taste of, of what he would do was very beneficial. Um, and then, I mean, I think I looked at, you know, I've looked at his, his website where he's listed a lot of pictures and just kind of browsed through those. So that was somewhat um, instrumental in, in knowing, you know, what he could do. So does that answer your question, Scott? Yeah, I think it does for them. We'll see. Okay, uh, we're going to do something next in the next process um, where I really try to aim to get it down to like 10 or 15 pictures. And you, you might have missed the part. Well, actually, you were watching him. You were looking at potential, right, of what these can become. And so that might be a little bit difficult. But so I want to do that because in the first, like, um, page that I'm going to submit you know, put on the gallery and so that your friends see them, so my friends, the photographers see them. I kind of just want to leave a really good first impression. Okay. Um, but I also want them to be ones that you like and that really describe you guys and your personality that are solid. So my goal on the next one is to get it down by half again, get it down to like 10 of the most awesomest pictures. So we're talking... The part that you... Uh, you know, it's hard for you, but hey, we got all of us together, and I've got my input as well. Okay. So we're talking, so let me make sure I understand. So you're going to pretty much give me two stars and up, but yeah. these are ones that you're going to actually put on um, to display, like on your yes. site. Okay, got yes. it. Yep. Yeah, so you got 51 pictures, which is that, that's kind of what we're talking about. Tim should be very proud of me. That's awesome. <laughs> you think that's great? Did you hear? <laughs> and we're about yeah. to just, yeah. Okay, so we've got um, thirty, and and your your opinion might change after you see the edits, obviously. So whatever. Okay. But uh, here we got the forty, and let's do this. Is this top ten? Am I the only one answering right now? Uh, others should join in too. Jennifer, Michael. I like the next one. I like yeah. that one better. Okay. Yep. And that, that's got the great ring highlight, too. Yep. Uh, I don't know if I put the single pictures up at the very beginning, though you look very handsome, Tim. You do look like handsome. Sometimes I will. <laughs> um, okay, we got a couple. We got one of these. Look at your expressions. Don't look at this is a little bright right now. Yeah, it is a little bright. I like I do like the expressions. I like that one the best actually. This one? No, nope, the next one. This one. Well, what do you guys think? Yeah, help her out. Help out of those two, out. out of those two, yes. Right. Okay. Okay. I love the framing on that. Agreed. Kelly. Are yeah, too, I like it. Are you too low? I might be a little too low, but it's kind of neat at the same time. It really is. I like the picture a lot. All right, we got the flower ones, and this is the our top I like, one. I do love that. I yeah, and I think this is cute, and this is the type of one that your girlfriends would go, oh. <laughs> <laughs> what was that again, Scott? <laughs> <laughs> yes. And this is yeah, one of my favorites. One. Perfectly framed. I like it. Yeah, other than my bottom looking a little bit big, that's <laughs> just kidding, it's fine. <laughs> well, I heard that Tim likes big looks and cats. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay. Uh, this one's really up to, to, I guess, the expressions in it. You know what I mean? It, it might not be, actually. Let's move next. Yes. I don't know. The elbow, whatever. <laughs> oh, no. Can we Photoshop in an elbow? <laughs> it's okay. We the next like one's it. really good. Yeah. Good she likes this one, don't you? Yeah. Great framing. Oh, and that one. I like that. I love that, too. That, that is a good I, one. 
I like that one. This one right yeah. here? Yeah. Okay. It's not um, like a dynamic no. expression. Mm -hmm. Yes. We're not even going to ask you. <laughs> Though I said individual is not always, but this one, yes, of course. Okay. And uh, I like that one, too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'd probably keep that. I'm going to say no that. on that one. You can have it. And really? Everything. Oh, I love that one. Okay. I know it's a cheesy, like, totally cliche pose, <laughs> but something about it. Nice. And you're going to use it, probably, and you're going to probably like it. It's just not going to be the one that 18, I represent. Yeah. Uh, Jarvi will do it. You yeah. don't have to. Uh, okay, that one. Yes. I'm going to ask. Yeah. That's obvious. And this one is obvious. Yeah. Yes. Very nice. And we got a couple of these ones. I really like your cute expression, you know, the way you get your legs I that like way. That. Yeah, I'd go with that one he over looks, the first one. He looks okay. really good in that one, too. So. Yeah, Tim does look good in that one. He looks good in, yeah, both of them. I like the other ones better. Than the one I picked? No, so I like those first two. The third one, that one I like, that one I like, that one's so-so. Okay. I mean, I, I love it, but maybe not for this 18. Okay. That one's kind of solid. Yeah. But I don't know. It's up to you. Go back one. One. Back one more. Is that too much greenery in front of it? No, or I'll make it work. I'm going to probably darken some of the, the other corner as well. Oh, okay. So, okay, if you like it, yeah, keep it. And I've got to darken the top right because of the way I had to put the flash on that little um, thing. It flashed too much of an area I didn't want flashed, so. I see. Okay. I like that. I like that one a lot. That yeah, the city ones are the. Okay, Kelly, tell us about these city ones. They're very pose specific. Like how much you like your guys' expressions. Um. Your like hair looks blowing. better in this one. I like one. the hair blowing. I <laughs> kind of like that too. The kind of the blow. It kind of works with the city background. Yeah. Or like in the windy city or something. Um, <laughs> yeah. So I, I would say yes on that one. Go back to the other one. I think. Oh, t does Tim has have his thumb in his pocket? No, his thumb's out of his pocket. So is he, it kind of looks like he's. I'm just, I might be seeing the pictures too small or something, but um, does, it, does that look funny to anybody else, like that he's like holding something? Or does it just look like his hand's on his hip? It doesn't look funny to me. But it doesn't look funny? Okay, I think I'm just not quite seeing it. Jennifer will tell us. Michael will tell us. I, I like that one too. The thumb looks a little bit weird. I can see what she's talking about. but Once you look at it. Yeah. But it's not a big deal. Yeah, it's okay. I like it's both. It's one of those you never notice until somebody tells you to look at it. Yeah, and you go. sorry. <laughs> okay, we weren't totally successful. At our <laughs> 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 so, which means I need to get it down another step. I mean, it's it's no hard and fast rule. I just go until I get it down to what I need to. So sometimes I'm done with three stars, and sometimes I have to go to five. So tell us. The very favorites. How many do we need to get rid of? We need to get we need to get down to like your top five. Ooh. Oh. So but we were successful in getting to eighteen. Yeah, we were trying to get to ten. Oh we were? Oh. Yeah. I thought you said ten to eighteen. Ten to oh uh, yeah. Well, I probably just said a number just Okay. <laughs> so now you need us down to, to five? Yeah. Which means you have a little leeway. Okay. Which five do you remember? Let's not even look at them one by one. The city one. Well, this one is an obvious yeah. with, the with the little river, for okay. me at least. Okay. I think the city one as well. And I think this path one. 
Yeah. yeah. Um, I like the dip one. I'm just doing these ones for you. <laughs> <laughs> I and take, I and the ring. The, the one. first one. The, the ring, ring one. Yeah, the ring is good. And the flowers. Yes. Yep. Which one did you said you wouldn't? I wouldn't pick the path one as my favorite of the like my yeah. of the five personally. Okay. That is good to know. I it would still will stay that way, but <laughs> <laughs> I would pick the one just under the door one. The one. Yeah. Where, yeah. I really. I think okay. that's awesome. I love the way the angle he's looking at me, and then I like the kind of look in my eye. I don't mm -hmm. know. I agree. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Great. Okay. And then, anything else stands out to anyone? Well, they all do, but. I think I like one of the. Yeah, yeah, yeah that yeah, one. Yeah, they all work. I but like that one. Those are the. Which one? Which one was I on? You were on this, that one. One of these two? That one. Uh, the other one. One over. One over to the right. That one. Don't you think? Okay. Yeah, I like it. Okay, so we're good. We got we got some really good ones that we know what to do with. And then just for uh, time's sake, um, on the on this uh, video, I am just going to edit, which I do, edit threes and above of 30 pictures, or edit the top 17, the top four and above. Let's do four and above, huh? Yeah, that's enough. That's enough. So uh, earlier there was another question that I said I was going to ask. Uh, Kelly, when you two decided to do these pics, did you know exactly what you were looking for, or were you more open to Scott's suggestions? I don't think we really knew. I, I guess I just knew that I wanted more of a formal picture to send with my engage, my, my wedding announcement. So I knew that I wanted something that would be like head to toe, you know, so you could see everything and have it be a little bit more formal. Um, how we got there, I think I was sort of relying on you a little bit, Scott. Mm -hmm. and I certainly, um, you know, I've, I've put together my outfits in that, but we picked the place that we picked because like I didn't really know a lot of places that might be good and it ended up turning out really really well probably a lot because Scott knows what he's doing you know um, but I think I really relied on you once we um, picked the spot to kind of pick the actual spots in there to make it right because I don't think I had much of an idea of how to how to do that, you know. Remember my suggestion with the stump. <laughs> <laughs> well, I told you to challenge me, right? <laughs> like, pick locations, challenge me. So. Yeah. Okay. Uh, a second ago, you probably that? saw the cursor that looked really like. What is this? What is this little arrows thing? And so everyone watching needs to just know that Google Hangouts cannot display the brush in Lightroom correctly. <laughs> So what you're seeing is the me making the brush smaller and larger right now. And this is the circle. <laughs> and you just won't be able to see it. Sorry about that. <laughs> and so what I was doing is dodging and burning, kind of just lightning and just figuring out a good contrast level. And, and I might try a different color, a little warmer. And um, there's actually a different color on his hand. And uh, so I'm going to warm up his hand separately with a brush. Um, and it's a little too... Anyways, and then I did, turned it quickly into black and white to see if I liked the contrast levels. And then I'm going to make a virtual copy mm -hmm. and do black and white option as well for you guys if you want. Scott, do you, do you keep copies of the originals too? Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, all right, here I'm going to do a uh, my own vignette, just darken the, the sides how I want them darkened. And that puts the emphasis on you guys. Kind of just splashes of darkness there. Um, contrast level. And that's good. That's the editing. <laughs> Not too bad. 
Uh, there's a little purple on him, so I just an auto white balance. Um, pick the right exposure. Uh, it is not quite, so I'm tilting it a little bit. And then I'm going to try the basic vignette. Oh, well, I'm going to do my own vignette. Here we go. Just darken the side. Darken in here. Hey, Scott, on the black and white, do you end up going back and doing that nick, or do you just stay all in light? I stay like this, yeah. So I'm actually, thanks for reminding me, doing black and white really helps you to figure out the contrast levels. And then you go back to color, and the contrast is even better. And then I'll just do a virtual copy real fast so that they have a black and white version. And here, um, it'll definitely good for... And it, these are if my my opinion on vignettes is you don't really want them to be seen. You don't want them to take attention, but you want the effect um, to be to, to draw attention in. So a little bit of I didn't burn in there. Um, and let's see. And remember how I told you to in this one's what I did right. I was like move your head forward an inch okay now back you know like just really because I was using such a shallow depth of field to get their eyes both in focus yeah. and it was a little bit off like Kelly is a little bit uh, a l tiny bit less in focus so what I've done is just used a brush to sharpen her back up a little bit to be to match him so and we can brighten their eyes and it's a close one right <laughs> but not too much, so it seems fakeish. And there we go. And then I also will do this. Tim, don't watch. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> that was going to be a request. I was going to okay. ask you privately, but yeah, that's fine. Okay. I'm not going to, like, make them, like, paper white, because yeah. that looks fake. But no it, TV it, announcer white? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, and that's hey, what I, like I would want for myself. They are, so you just stop it, Scott. <laughs> What's that? Oh, okay. I said I like Tim sees how they are. <laughs> We'd do it to you, too, if it was the close-up and you had your elbow. <laughs> yeah, I know. And and you can see kind of like, um, yeah. Okay, tilt this one. Da -da -da. And you can kind of see a blacked out version. I don't want just the half of that mm -hmm. light thing, so I'm going to come in. And then I'm going to come up a tad. And... Is it even? It's a little tough. There are. It wasn't straight on, so it's not going to ever be perfectly even, unless I spend a lot of time. Whatever. Boop, boop, boop. Maybe not. It was fine. Was it? Uh, oops, I'm doing the wrong one. Oh, there's the right one. Mm. Oh, whatever. That's good. Um, and then, because uh, I cropped in, I lost the natural vignette that cameras give you. So I'm going to put it back in there. Well, and because I like the vignettes anyways. Oh, and there's no rhyme or madness to what I do first, because I didn't do the exposure first, and obviously needed a little bit in the contrast. But the first thing I did was... There's a question about your crop dimensions, Jarvie. Uh, I don't mind what crop dimensions. I just do whatever looks best for the pictures. Um, and then I worry about what print size they're going to do later. Yeah, because you're still at 40, 4,500 by 6,900 deep. Yeah. So <laughs> I, don't, I don't worry about it. I just make it look good for viewing, video viewing or whatever. And then we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. If they want to do like a 4 by 6 of this, there's, you know, plenty they can do. 
or an 8x10, you know. Um, actually might warm this one up a little bit. Okay, and then next. Doesn't need much on this one. I'm gonna do a dash of light on their face. I, you know, light, the lighting and the color of faces are a big deal to me. So. Oh, that's cute up close. <laughs> and there's actually a little fringe around it, so I don't worry about it too much and worry about it, when, you know, if and when it gets printed. But let's do that because we're zoomed in anyways. Um, so she did say something. So what we'll do is make a virtual copy of this. So we have the zoomed out version. And then we're going to do a zoomed in version with the corner leading right to that. Mm. Okay. There you go. Okay. You have an up close version as well. Thanks, Scott. <laughs> Two different pictures. I just doubled the amount of good pictures I just did. <laughs> and that's why I do uh, black and white a lot, too. It's like, hey, extra good pictures. <laughs> and uh, speaking of black and whites, we're going to give... Oh, yeah. Never mind. Oh, I, I could have done some of these. Let's see if they how this one looks in black and white. I didn't get enough big enough a, a, a response. <laughs> I liked it. I gave a thumbs up. Oh, did you? I I didn't mind it either. I liked it just like. Nope, not big enough ex response. <laughs> <laughs> I know I have to be like all excited. Yeah, you have to be giggly. <laughs> oh my gosh! He knows me too well. Oh, <laughs> that one should go well in black and white. I think so. And I'm happy that a lot of our flip flop teeth turned out well because I've never been very good at that. I'm surprised how many I'm smiling without teeth. <laughs> you don't find his shoulder there a little bright, Charlie? I did darken a tad. Oh, okay. I can do it again. Um, let's see it. And black and white. Hmm. Yeah. I think it works better now. <laughs> I'll do it anyways. Black and white version. Yeah, right. A little shadow. Do you, do you want to make my tricep look a little bit no. more <laughs> defined? You don't want Photoshop body. I'm just teasing, really. Don't, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> I don't even have Photoshop, sorry. <laughs> Man, we are yellow teeth people, both uh, of us. It's, it's also the white balance I'm using. It's a, okay. It's a very warm white balance, you know. That's a trick you tell clients. It was a warm white balance, I swear. <laughs> no, you, no, you don't have yellow teeth. No, no. Yeah. Okay, Weston is asking about the dodging and burning uh, brush settings. Um, my brush settings, I've just created a few. I've created, like, darken and lighten. And so my <laughs> darken is just down by half a stop, basically. Um, and it seems to work. And if I'll put it on there and it's not enough, I'll just adjust the settings, you know, like a little bit darker. Um, and we'll go to lighten in a second. Um, hit new, lighten, it's up by less than, it's like 0.3, you know. So I'm just going to put it over their faces real fast. Um, there you go. Actually, let's sharpen, selectively sharpen Kelly's eyes. Oh, I softened them. That doesn't look good. <laughs> but I can change the setting to sharp after I've applied the filter. So, um, oh yeah, let's see, black and white. Oh yeah, that'll be good. I just love that one. I don't know what it is. 
Well, and do you re remember me asking about this one so much? Like, I didn't know. Like, I'm like, this one could be good. I just don't know what people react to it. Yeah, it really grew on us when you were talking about it. When it, You almost left this one on the one-star bin. Yeah, I well, almost didn't even pick these. I, like I really it. wanted to know what people thought. <laughs> Maybe I should have just trusted my... That worked. Um, let's see here. I think this will be a good black and white, just saying. On the black and white, you're using a preset or just the straight black and white? Just, I just said black and white. I think I think the trick for me the trick to black and white is the correct amount of contrast. Look away. <laughs> okay there. Not that bad. No, it's good. We're just up really close. Got one on the jawline you might want to get. Yeah, right there. Oh, thanks. Sorry. <laughs> Just want to say it in some time. I'm glad we've been friends for seven years. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. Yeah, up close of your face. But I know how much you like this, so I want this one to be look good in case you print well, it. You also do have one extra um, red vein in her eye you might want to. Touch, oh, I don't know if I ever get that detail. Oh, okay. Sorry. Well, shit. Oh, wow. And now she knows. <laughs> now she will. Now you have to do it. I can't do that one in, in Lightroom. Oh, okay. It's, it's Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. Now you know my eyes better than I know them. <laughs> uh, that is definitely not a Lightroom type thing. That does look good black and white. That looks great. Yeah, that mm -hmm. looks good black and white. Okay, um, this one needs help with color. I think one of the things we can do is that will help a lot. I changed the hue of the greens. Mm -hmm. And I definitely got to straighten it out which is sad because I'm missing part of the top. Let's check it out. Is it straight? Yeah, there we go. Yeah. And then... Yeah. Anybody is whispering to each other? Sweet nothing. We we were just saying Tim was wondering where everybody was from, where they were all calling in from. Yeah, okay. Jennifer is from Florida. Cool. Michael. San Jose, California. Great. Scott. Tempe, Arizona. There we go. Wow. Right and on. online, if you guys could also in the event mention where you're from. I know there's at least a dozen watching. Okay. We've seen yeah. them. I don't know how to see. I still haven't figured out how to see the text. When they when they write, it's a delay. So when they write, I'll mention. Okay, cool. Yeah, just say it. Well, thank you to everybody. This is a really neat idea. Thank you to you, Kelly. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Having you guys is awesome. This is really helpful. <laughs> Good. So these colors are great, and so I'm going to copy them to the next picture because it's the same set of colors. So if you'll look from beforehand, just I didn't even do anything to this picture. I just copied from the previous settings. Well, I guess it was already good. Never mind. I don't know what I'm talking about, apparently. <laughs> uh, this tree is just kind of like random here. Let's see if we can't get rid of it. That's going to be hard. There we go. It's gone. Wow. Yeah. We'll keep your shoes in here, Tim. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and it's sock. <laughs> I'm actually going to lighten it up so that you can it's see kind of <laughs> Yeah. Highlight it. Yeah. 
I actually wanted to get the shoes in there, so I missed hers though. They're like right there, but they're kind of cut off. So we got Fort Worth, um, uh, L.A., Boston, Fort Worth, Sacramento, and Kansas City. This who's responded so far. That is so cool. That is awesome. We had earlier, uh, yeah. she had to go to bed because it was 3 a.m. So. Um, Where was she? Greece. Oh. Yeah. She's an awesome photographer from, uh, from Greece. Yeah. Wow. At the very beginning, we had uh, New Jersey. He had to go. So. All right, uh, just a couple more. And then the next kind of steps after that are like posting them. And, uh, you know, a picture just, you know, it needs to be seen. That's the final final step. So um, usually I just kind of post them up there and, some, you know, encourage the, the clients to put them up there or, you know, like on Facebook, tag them so they go onto their wall. Mm -hmm. um, and we can ask what you guys are planning on doing. How did you learn all the shortcuts in Lightroom, Jarvie? Uh, Just by doing? Yeah. I mean, I was around for the beta of Lightroom before Lightroom ever came out. Yeah, that was like, whatever, how many years ago. Now they're on Lightroom 4, you know? So mm -hmm. I was on Lightroom 0.5, so... And they've stayed the same, mostly, so I've just kind of been there. What, what's your product again, Scott, that you're using? It's called Adobe Photoshop Lightroom. People just oh, call it Lightroom. Okay. So this is for photographers. Phot photography. And there's a couple of bugs floating around that we're going to get rid of. <laughs> or this was spit. I don't know. Yeah, one of those. <laughs> <laughs> So much saliva going around with this kiss. No kidding. That one would look good up close, too. I think. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm going to fix the sharpening. Yeah, there we go. You all, all need right. to understand, Tim and I, well, at least for Utah, we're kind of old. We've been dating around a, for a long time, and we finally found the, you know, I'm going on 30, he's 32, and uh, we're, we're pretty excited that it's finally worked out. <laughs> Yay. We saw so, your video, Tim. Oh, good. Oh, uh, cool. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> he's very talented. He's a great artist. He's so good. So anyway, okay. that's why we like to kiss so much. We just, you know, we've been waiting for this for a very I long time. I love that you're just so open about that. It's so great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tim's like, yeah, like, great. Like, <laughs> 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 He's a bubble one. <laughs> all right, tell all your friends to watch this on YouTube afterwards. Oh, are you taping this? It's taped, yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so here's the other version up close. So you want to see, see the dip between the two of them? Mm -hmm. Robin says you guys are not old. Well, I say you're no, not she, old either. She did say for, for this, this area, for this community. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all of our friends have been married for, you know, six to hey, eight years. What about not, me? All. <laughs> not all of our friends. <laughs> Some of them that are even older are still single and in this community. I liked both of those, Scott. You did a good job. On oh, thanks. Fun. I actually edited this one earlier today, but I actually want to make a black and white version. Did you like that I made one of them for you for your uh, Facebook cover? Which yeah, one of these would you? Which one of these would you use for your Facebook cover? Um. You have to have like a long skinny one, you know? That, yeah. That's yeah. Picture, right? I would did you use the same you use the same picture just just squished it, right? Or like made it long. Yeah, I made a you know, I cropped off the top and bottom. The top, yeah. Yeah, I think I would end up using that one for sure for the oh, really? the length the longer one because it's already fits, you know. Mm -hmm. And you and I had you tell me which parts should be shown and which parts shouldn't instead of me like adjusting it, you know. Yeah. 
Okay. Might do this a little bit warmer. There you go. A little bit counts. Okay. Uh, what about black and white on this one? It looks pretty good. Black and white. Might as well. Just makes me have twice as many good ones. <laughs> <laughs> this one you're, needs to be straightened. And then because I straightened out some of the, you know, some of the natural vignette from the camera got cropped out. I'm going to put it back in. And I do it with a very feathered kind of look, and his shirt's a little bright. And I actually want to lighten up hers so that her shirt can be stand out a little bit more. My shirt, it, it is a dress. <laughs> oh, yeah, that too. I know it's not very long. <laughs> It's not a very long dress. Oh my gosh, <laughs> Kelly! It's really long though, right? Scandalous, scandal, scandal. A night shirt for our form. And you said you like this one, huh? So I might do this one as a, um, as a as a panorama type thing as well. That could be a nice panorama. So you have another one to do later down the line, you know. Yep. Um, and the question here is, well, let's let's do this. Oops, just a second. Crop. I'm actually thinking about doing this. Would you be sad? What did you do? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it was one I was just probably holding the flash in one hand and trying to get the picture with the other, trying to get it in focus. Yeah. No, that's okay if that's what looks the best. I think it's a nice contrast uh -huh. to have the other color with my legs still in the picture, but it, it I'm good either way. Okay. Well, the... the uh, the solution is, I'm going to do them both, you know. <laughs> so it's really easy. It doesn't even actually add any space to my computer. <laughs> actually, this is going to be part of, because you need the really skinny one. So that's what we're going to do here. Mm, maybe down a little bit. OK. And then put back the little vignette. And I think that the flash just kind of hit the shirt a little hard, so I'm going to put back a little bit of shadow in there. Oops, wrong button. Yeah, that's the right amount. Yeah. So, who people are following my quick actions? <laughs> and the last one here. Let's see. People could be asking 851 by 351 for the cover photo on Facebook. Yeah. I never knew that, actually. <laughs> we could actually do that just for fun of it. Ready? <laughs> so, we're going to go and enter custom. Mm -hmm. 851 by 351. And we were about right. No, we're going to miss the um, Ooh, you're gonna miss spots. The lights. Yeah. And those lights are really cool. But I can't go too far too close to his hand. Yeah. All right, we got a little bit of lights. And I think that's fine. That's no. about as good you're going to get. This is like perfectly for you guys. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you to whoever gave us the dimensions. <laughs> yeah, Weston. Uh oh. <laughs> and now he says it's 315. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what happened? It's 315, not 351. Oh. You can that finger. Say goodbye to the lights. <laughs> oh, no. 
Character custom. 851 by 315. Lights are going away. <laughs> oh, no. They are gone. Oh, sad. <laughs> that is really skinny. That is pretty thin. Yeah. That's what she said. <laughs> bad Jerry, bad Jerry. Uh, you heard that? You're not going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? Nothing. <laughs> oh, nothing. Yeah. Where's that other one? Um, the other one that I made. Croft. It's over to the right. There it is. It was at three. St it was at. So I actually want to make this one the right one. What is it for Google? Uh oh. Yeah. Chat room. <laughs> Yeah, help us. Scott, can you, I really like just how this is too, so can you make sure you keep that too and then. Do another skinnier one? Okay. Yeah. Done, just did it. I, okay, I just love the framing on that. It just, and yeah, I'm, it I'm actually worried that this isn't going to work at three, at that dimension. But we'll give it a shot. It might, what might have to happen is I. No, I had it the right, just about the right way. Nice. Now, I mean, this is skinnier, so. Yeah, that's a little skinnier. But it still looks good. 940 by 180. Holy crap, really? That is but it has a, a 250 by 250 um, square cut out of it, you know, on the right-hand side. Yeah. On, on what? On the Facebook? No, Google, Google Plus. Plus. Oh, really? You know how you usually get the you get the the billboard, but then you get the the picture of like you. Okay. Standing there looking majestic. That one. Yeah. Okay. All right. You guys are models. <laughs> oh. Um, Robin, are you asking it, what does this one with the river look like moved up? Where we're that's a very definite option. I think she's talking about the hands being cut off. The other one. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, I didn't catch it quite in time. Yeah, we could get the lights and just have your hands cut off, but I really like the hands. Yeah. It's probably gonna look fine. Uh, <laughs> We're ready to move on, I guess. <laughs> Lots of options. Or cheat and just put move the lights down, yeah. Oh. Yeah, right. Yeah. Again, no Photoshop. Oh, okay. <laughs> Jarvie has limitations. Yeah. <laughs> Very convenient limitations, too. Yeah. <laughs> darn it, don't have Photoshop. Ah, darn it. <laughs> Wish I did. Oh. oh, I don't have a change for 100. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> okay, there you go. So then what I'm going to do next, um, we pretend like we're completely done, even though there are 20 or so more pictures to edit. Um, is, uh, what did we do, all four stars and above? There you are. You have 31 pictures because of our virtual copies and stuff like that to go mm -hmm. with right now. Yay. And uh, the assumption is because you chose these, you're going to be good for a little bit, and I'll work on the others later. <laughs> <laughs> Hold yeah, on, you chose some of those, Scott. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I did. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So I'm going to export these to my computer as full-size pictures, and then I'll put them onto Smug Mug, because what they need is they're going tomorrow to go get these all printed. And on, on Smug Mug, I'm going to open it so that you can download. You'll be able to scroll over the picture, Kelly, okay. and, you'll, and you'll see save photo, and you're going to be able to save the full size files. Okay. And they're going to be large. They're going to be like 15 to 20 megs. Okay. As JPEGs. Um, really big. That's huge. Yeah. Um, let me just double check. Did I do the... 
Wait. I don't think you did that last one. You didn't edit it, did you? Or did you? I did a little, yeah. But I didn't do this. And um, you'll be able to save photo, and then mm -hmm. what else is there to do? And then you can just uh, drag and drop, or right click and save. But if you just, you can just like grab the picture off a of smug mug and drag it onto your desktop, and then cool. you can use those. They're going to be perfectly like the ones from there. They're going to be perfectly set up for um, for use like online. They're going to be the right dimensions and everything. And they'll have my tiny little watermark, but it's really small these days. And it's, you know, a thing of pride. <laughs> you can show of off course. to all your friends. Just <laughs> um, and then, you want to do that then? Put your, your own pictures up tonight or tomorrow or whenever? Yeah. Well, um, hmm. let me think. I'll refrain from Facebook. and you, But yeah, I'll probably you, put some on Google+. Plus. Yeah, you go ahead, and in fact, I don't know, would we care? But if I tag you, they're going to go onto yours. I don't know. Can I get back to you on that, Scott? Just sure. refrain, refrain from Facebook right now. Okay. Um, and then, but I'll, I'll let you know. Okay. So this next thing, I don't know how well the Hangout's going to handle me exporting pictures. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Kelly Tim Kelly Tim. And on my export someone asked about your export settings on for printing. Uh don't really have many. Just full size files. I do limit size file size to fifty megs. Believe it or not, I've had one <laughs> be more than 50 megs big. That's crazy. And Smug Mug doesn't ha handle over 50 megs, so 50 megabytes. It's a little bit big. Sometimes I'll put Sharpen 4, and I don't know this answer very well, so I'm just like, uh, green, standard, whatever. I don't care. They look fine, you know? Yeah. Export. Am I still... Sound all right? Here. Are there any other final questions? And we're going to um, stop this in a moment. When are you Someone getting your D4, Jarvie? Uh, when I start doing more night wow. photography. Mm. I will. I think we've covered most of the questions and stuff. So what do you think, Kelly? I like them. <laughs> Good. Yeah, I like them a lot. I'm excited to get all of them, um, but I think we made some good choices here. Yeah, and it won't take me too long. How long was the editing portion? What, how long was the, in percentage, um, the first pick, the rest of the picks, and the editing? Like, in three parts, what would you put the percentage? And put that on the event type thing. Again, our very initial going through the 590 pictures, and then doing all of our rating, one to five, and then, um, and then the editing. And don't count in the times that we're just chatting, you know? Like, what would your opinion of the three parts be? Percentage, like, 30, 30, well, 30, 30, 40, 33, 33, 33. That's 33 is what I said. Or, I, you know, for me, it's almost like the editing was almost the shortest portion. But maybe I'm making that up. <laughs> I wasn't here for the beginning, so I'm not sure. Yeah, it came But then again, I think we only edited half the pictures that we were going to edit. In the end, we the we edited probably. the four stars, is that right? Yeah, four and five. Four and five, and then there's still a few in two and three, right? That are... Uh, let's see. 
we were doing just threes. That's what you did earlier. You're like, I want this one, I want this one, I want this one. So you moved all the ones that you wanted up to, oh, no, you moved them all up to two, didn't you? Yeah, I think we... It's it's going so slow, I can't figure it out. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, 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 there it is. It's not going that slow. Yeah, all the twos and above. Okay. All right, thanks, everyone, for joining us. Thanks, Scott. Thanks, guys. Thank you, Scott. This thanks, will Garvey. be available later. Congratulations to Kelly and Tim. Thank you. <laughs> nice you guys. Thanks for joining us. You guys, th this was priceless. Like, we got the best, you know, review of getting our best pictures that we could have ever even asked for. So thank you for joining. This was awesome. Yay! Bye-bye. Yeah. Congratulations. Good luck to all of you. <laughs> Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. And we'll, we'll, we'll end with her favorite picture here. <laughs> Yay. All right. Thanks. Bye.